All right, 2020 is almost over. Hope everyone's doing well, staying positive. This project here took place out in Sacramento, or actually Fair Oaks. In this video, we're gonna show you how we go about building the back of the retaining wall. Probably gonna end up doing three or four videos for this project, so be sure to subscribe to our channel so you can be the first one to be notified. Shout out to White Cow for making an on-time delivery with over 45 2x12s or 22x4s. One of the main details of this retaining wall was to follow the existing grade, so our Bosch laser here was in full effect. Most of our retaining walls, we always frame the front of the footing. This allows us to get the exact measurement to the face of the wall. After we frame for the footing, we add our main stakes, as you can see here. Most are set at four to six feet on center. Now, the height of the stakes depend on the height of the wall. In this section, it's about 35 feet long, seven feet high. So each one of these stakes are about 10 feet high. Once we get our main stakes in place, it's just a matter of us stacking them like Legos when we was little kids. Now as we stack them, we're using our Stabila Smart Level to make sure they stay level and plumb. Sometimes when you drive the stakes in the ground, they tend to move. Be sure to stay to the end of the video, you get a quick peek of us installing the rebar and framing for the front. Here we have a shot of us using our drone to get the last board up and me going over some details with the client. So here we're playing musical chairs with our ladders. Quick note here, these ladders was on sale for Black Friday at Home Depot. $69 I believe. I waited a whole year to get these. Cause last year I missed the sale. I believe the regular price is $180. i am always looking for deals. Okay, so we're going to move to the side here. The process is pretty much the same, but on the side here we got to pay attention to the detail of the step down of the existing retaining wall. So that pretty much wraps it up for part one. Again, we're gonna have a part two of us installing the rebar and closing up the front. Here are a few pictures to give you some details of what it takes to install the retaining wall. Well, the backside of a retaining wall. So I appreciate you guys' time. Bay Area, Sacramento, hit us up, description below. And remember, stay positive, hang around people that are positive, and 2020 is almost over. Catch you guys on the next one.